hey guys i know it has taken me you know what i think my hands are looking a bit dry hold on can't be having dry hands what's that what kind of behavior is that one hey guys welcome back to my channel i'm so happy that i'm doing another video and literally i feel like my consistency is actually starting so i'm really happy about that if you guys watched my last week's video i spoke all about organizing your time and i gave you top three tips on how to do that especially where i work full time i am an entrepreneur and there's just so many other things that i'm doing as well so definitely 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 if you struggle with ha knowing how to organize your time then go and watch that video i'll put the description in the link i'll put the description i'll put the link in the bio yeah <laughs> that's what i'm gonna do um today's video guys <laughs> fitness yes i have finally done this fitness video this long overdue video that you guys have been getting on to me about and i'm sorry i'm really sorry but guys it's proper worth it you're gonna see amazing results and it is all about glutes yeah glutes now glutes for some people who don't know it's your booty the muscles in your booty i really struggle so i've been an active gym goer for four four years i don't even know how long and one of the things that i really hated was i have really big thighs and i have a booty and obviously i have a small waist <clears throat> and when you're obviously trying to continue to have that small waist and you continue to try to do them squats you struggle with your legs and you're like but why are my thighs growing like i'm getting muscular and it's okay to be muscular it's okay to have a bit of muscle in your legs but you don't want to look like a man who has muscles do you know what i mean so what i'm about to show you today is some of the things that i've been doing in the gym and you guys are going to be so happy about it why i'm doing it what benefits it brings and how and why and all that type of good jazz so without further ado let's get into this fitness video but one thing that i start off with is i have started to do running oh, gosh guys if you know me i hate treadmills i hate running i do go to spin classes as well guys so if you have spin classes inside of your um gym center then be sure to jump on it because those spin classes are really good you lose about 300 to 500 calories in one session it's proper amazing it's hard work but honestly if you're like me and you don't really like the conventional cardio then that is something i would definitely recommend especially because you're in a class so it gives you that motivation and determination that you need so I have also started to incorporate treadmill and the reason why is because my spin class is now always fully booked which annoys me um, but what I have started to do is I will put the incline on 15 which is the highest so the highest form and I will walk for 10 minutes on a 4.8 yeah so I usually um, will do that and I'll kind of march as I'm going like doing it and one thing I've invested in which helps me with my walking and making sure I listen to some music it's some headphones guys these headphones are life like they're wireless um, I got them the other day in TK Maxx for £18, which I'm so happy about because I really, really needed some. And I've been saying it for a year. No one bought it for me. I didn't buy it for myself. So, you know, it didn't happen. But I took them to the gym the other day and um, I went on the treadmill. And honestly, it gave me the motivation with the music I was listening to to just pump and go. So 10 minutes, I walk on an incline. And then for the next 10 minutes, I try <laughs> my hardest to do one minute run and then a one minute walk, one minute run, one minute walk and I try to do that for 10 minutes as well guys I'm sorry for my bra shows every now and again I do apologize um so I do that after I've done my warm-up or after I've done spin I then get cracking after I've done my cardio I've warmed my body up um I then stretch I don't really like to stretch on cold muscles so I normally try to warm up first and then I'll stretch my muscles out ready for my proper um weight training workout so usually I do five different workouts and I'll do 10 to 12 reps um but sometimes the 10 to 12 reps will go down to maybe eight reps um depending on the weight that I'm using so if I'm using a weight that I'm not normally used to then I will try to reduce the amount that I'm trying to do in terms of my reps and I do three sets of everything mm, that actually I do four to five sets of everything but three sets of 10 to 12 reps is really really good so if you can get that done then you're really off to a good start so then what I would normally do is I'll do a hip thrust so I'm going to show you guys now um, the hip thrust is amazing it is a good way of not adding too much weight on your legs but you are still carrying muscle to work on your glutes and I think they are absolutely amazing 
thing you get really really good results with these i tend to well i started off with doing five kgs um well i started off actually without um any weight at all then i went up to five kgs and now in a session i will do three sets um and i'll do 10 to 12 reps start off at 5 kg on the first set second set go up to 10 kg last set go up to 15 kg and i definitely have seen a difference when doing this workout like i can see my waist appear smaller but the only reason that it appears smaller is because my bum is actually lifting so my glutes are actually working and they're lifting up the muscles so that is one workout then the other machine that i use is i also use a leg press but i don't think i've got it in this video but basically the leg press is very simple you put your legs up and you put a weight inside of the weight machine and then you lift your legs so if this is your legs you do it like this you get your left leg you push it to the side like this and then you use it and you cut and just push so you're kind of facing this way so say this is my leg and I'm pushing sideways and that also helps your glutes so that's what I do kind of working your your fires um a little bit but it's not too much as you would if you was doing straight up squats with the um machine my all-time favorite and you can do at home if you don't have a gym membership is donkey kicks donkey kicks are bay you are just literally lifting your leg up some people put weights on their ankles which i'm hoping to start doing as well once i get it one of the last workouts that I do which I absolutely love is abductors so you guys will see that in here as well and I absolutely love 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 this workout it really really does work I've been doing it for as long as I've even known about the machine so I've been doing it for some years now and I absolutely love it it means everything to me um so yeah that is what I do I don't know why my voice sounds really broken but hey it is what it is um that is my glutes workout now tell me what you guys want to see when it comes to fitness um because i do really struggle like i don't know what you want to see and obviously i do need a friend to be able to record me whilst i'm in the gym and stuff like that so let me know what type of vi videos you want to see and i will make sure that i incorporate them in my fitness little area i am gonna go now guys i hope you really enjoyed that video and it gave you a bit more insights as to what you should do in the gym and how easy it is as well um on your how many times do i go gym i'll answer i'll answer a few questions that you guys might have so i tend to go gyms on tuesdays thursdays and saturdays sometimes i might go on a wednesday sometimes i might go on a friday depending on how i feel but i try to go a minimum of three times a week and then i try to be active on the days that i'm not when i say active i've got like a workout game on connect xbox that i love playing so i normally will just kind of whip that on and do a bit of like fitness like um and also i work in um i work as well so my work kind of i'm not in the office all day so that kind of make me makes me walk around a lot as well so that is what i do but guys be sure to like comment and subscribe and i will see you in my next video deuces bye you made it to the end of the video seriously give yourself a round of applause here guys you can see my website lalaray.com and on there I also have a blog which I feature my thoughts, feelings as well as my personal styles, fashion styles and it has links on there as well. I will also be putting my YouTube videos up on there as well and if you get bored at the bottom of the page you can subscribe to lalaray.com. If you want to do any bookings whether that's mentoring sessions, public speaking then this is the page that you need to come to. It's got my scheduling there and you'll see there's also social media public speaking, Instagram promo, photo and video shoots and you can fill out that form and get to speak to me more on that side of things. I have Dare Lala Ray, which is an amazing page. It's where you can be anonymous, share your most thoughts and feelings where you need a bit of advice and I answer them anonymously. If you don't have the funds for the mentoring session then this is the place that you need to be. There is also some questions already on there that you guys can read, especially if it's something that may end up relating to you, then please do check that out as well. And most importantly, if you want to know a bit more about me and my silly ass ways, then be sure to come and read this. Oh my gosh, look at me. And don't forget to subscribe to my YouTube page. Bye!